My name is Jim Estes, and today I'm going to talk about a drill that I think is extremely important for the swing plane. So what I want you to do is, and this, by the way, is going to give you an instant understanding of exactly the feeling you want to have in the golf swing. Take a club. You can put a rod, alignment rod, in the grip, or I'm sorry, in the butt end of the golf club. Take the golf club, turn it like you're going to hold it, and then what I want you to do is take that club, put it right against your left hip, so you're holding both clubs here. Now you've got an alignment rod on the ground and a golf ball. And what I want you to do, getting into your good posture position, your weight over the arches, getting feel balanced. The insides of the heels are going to be about the width of your hips. Take a swing back, slow motion, and trace with that alignment rod the target line all the way up. The shaft should be parallel to your target line at the top. And then slowly coming down, trace the line. And do this in slow motion. Right into the impact position. So this is a great feedback tool, visual feedback tool, for learning the proper swing plane. Go right to your impact position. I encourage you to do this drill in slow motion. And if you have five minutes a day, if you do this drill every day, I guarantee you're going to improve your golf swing. So again, I think you'll find this to be extremely helpful. JimEstesGolf.com if you have any questions. Eric, the other thing we did with your golf swing is we got your right hand grip a little more on top of the golf club. And you can see this gentleman on the right hand screen. The crease formed between the thumb and forefinger here is going to be either at your chin or between your chin and your right shoulder. You can see in your grip, your right hand is too far underneath the club there. And that's going to cause you to hook the ball. In addition, what I want you to do is turn your right toe forward, not letting your right knee collapse laterally on the backswing. You can see your right knee shifts outward. And also, obviously, the swing we want to keep shorter and keep, you know, keep the golf club, your hands a little more in front of you. You see how there's some distance his hands are from the center of his chest. We want to maintain some width in the golf swing. Very important to maintain width. And your golf swing, you tend to get it a little bit wrapped around behind you, and you, get a, you lose a little bit of stability in your lower body. Here you get the left elbow a little bit off the chest. You can see how he strikes the ball. The, the left arm stays on the chest, and the hands rotate. The club face rotates with the turn of the body.